this silly little guy is the yapuk or the water opossum and it is a type of marsupial that is native to Mexico and Central America. Now, it is called the water opossum because it is semi-aquatic, and it is the most aquatic out of any marsupial ever. This is the one that likes going in the water the most. Now, it has a couple of very interesting adaptations to help it go in the water, including a long, strong tail to kind of help power it, short, dense, mostly waterproof fur, and those feet which are mostly webbed in the back to use as propulsion in the water, and just kind of weird looking. The Yapok is also the only living marsupial where both sexes, male and female, have a pouch. The other one was the now extinct thylacine, so this guy is the only one currently living. Now, there's also some interesting adaptations for that as well that they have adapted to go into the water in the females, that's where the babies are. So they have to close up super tight to avoid the babies getting soaked and occasionally drowning. So the muscles in the female's pouch are super, super strong. And when they go underwater, they tend to just clench really tightly to basically fully seal the pouch so no water can get in. Now, the males also have a pouch, and that is not for baby carrying, but it does have a function. It has been observed that when the males go under the water, that is where their reproductive organs go. They just stick them right inside that pouch. Now, the reason for that is not entirely confirmed, but it is hypothesized that it's just put in there for protection while they're swimming so they don't get tangled in, like, seaweed and other underwater plants, which, like, yeah, I can see that being a little bit of a problem, I guess. But all in all, they're just, just a weird little guy.